I'm sorry about that, guys. I uh, had to get called away. A uh, little bit of family business, but uh, I'm back now and we'll continue. Let's just carry on with our journey, eh? To get to the main mission. Yeah, I got uh, I got family in New Zealand, and uh, they were on a call and wanted to speak to me. So sorry about the disruption there. Up with him anyway. Go away. Oh, another cranky old bloke by the sounds of it. Say go away, boy. Do not speak the king's English. Mm. Think he's a bit worse away there, don't you? No, I didn't see you there, old man. <laughs> I'd have set my home in order if I'd known you'd be calling. The boy's name is Connor. He's here to restore the property. Restore? Restore? Pardon my manners. She's still the fastest in the Atlantic. Sure, she needs some attention. Minor things mostly. Good Lord, but some attention. A little affection she'll fly. <laughs> she needs more than that. Who is she? Who is she? Why, the Aquila boy. The ghost of the North Seas. The boat. Well, uh, uh, Boat? She's a ship boy, and make no mistake a boat. about it. A boat? I thought you brought him here. She's the finest liner on the I seas. The greenest <laughs> thing on the frontier. Connor. Oh dear. Meet me back at the manor when you've finished here. You said it requires repairs. You able? She does need work. A ship is a she boy. And yes, yeah, I remember that. But I'm lacking in the proper supplies. Some some quality timber would help me get started. I can see to that. How long before it she is able to sail again? Just get me the lumber boy. And I'll raise a crew. <laughs> yeah, if you ever wake up. Okay. And now I've got to go over there again. I'm out. Quickest route, I suppose, rather than swimming. Every time we dive into that water, you can just imagine I'm freezing. Getting up that way, I don't think. I don't think I can jump it, that's for sure. No, he's not gonna let me. Oh, right. Like, yeah, might let me climb it. There we go. Very often that happens on these. So. Okay, there we go. Good climbing there, Connor. Something to show you. Come, take a look. What is it? A ledger. It lets us manage the homestead's dealings. And right, they... okay. Uh, that was years ago. Before the slow fever, before the Templars, before everything collapsed. 
but that's all in the past. Yeah, most things are. focus on what's in front of us. Take up the ledger, and I'll teach you how it all works. Okay. How many do you reckon we need? Let's go buy all three. Yep. Okay. You've got to send it to the trader to make the wood that we need, blah blah blah. Yeah, okay. The stock Time it passed quickly after that. My days a blur of study. Yeah, even got sales on it, look. Even I made that a book. What little free time Achilles <laughs> allowed me was spent learning about the Templars. Oh, about clever Charles this kid, isn't he? My father. I longed to confront them, to put an end to their schemes, to ensure my people would remain untroubled and free. Well, uh, yeah. But I knew it was too soon. That to approach them now would see me killed. All my work would be for nothing. Patience, restraint. These proved the most okay, difficult subjects for thing, me. Because that's what I'm supposed to do. Okay. But in time, I mastered them as well. Days became months. Months became years, and as my skills and knowledge grew, so too did I. Yeah, oh, smash. You know, swimming again, though. At least it's the uh, six months later now, it's not freezing. <laughs> uh, I don't mind the swim. It's nice and warm. This is always a decent swimmer, isn't it? We have the crew, we're gonna let me on. Today. Come aboard and feast your eyes, boy. No, 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 not the left foot. Never the left foot. Horrible look. <laughs> Step with your right foot. Oh, he's the right foot. Be bad luck otherwise. Don't want to be doing that. <laughs> and sleek. She'll fetch 12 knots in a stiff gale, near a ship from here to Singapore can outrun her on her best day. What do you say we take her out? Show you what she can do first hand. I know. Where would we go? As it happens, she still needs guns and the officers to command them. We'll launch straight away. <laughs> Don't worry, lad. I'll make sure you sprout good sea legs. <laughs> sprout good sea All legs, eh? Sail. Get up the rigging! Like a vegetable. <laughs> Come on, men. Let's get her out where she needs to be. 
You are. He goes again. Another adventure. Oh, they've done well there. He's safe there, and that's only no on, one man. type of music. Check the hatches. Get up! On come on, come on, she won't bite. There you go. You're connected to a half sail. Ah! Your killer flies again. Do you feel it, lad? Do you feel it? Do you feel it? Of course, for Martha. Wind in your ear. We'll find our guns and officers there. Okay, She's so we're going another way. But the faster she goes, the more cumbersome she grows, and the firmer your hand needs to be. Enjoy this stretch of open water before we come upon those shallows. Call okay. for full sail if you like. Let fly full sail. We need full every knot. Full sail. Here we go. Hailing the seven seas again. Wind looks to be shifting. Stay alert, Connor. Gusty winds can be difficult to manage. Ah, well. Just turn into it and be fine. Oh, for that ship. Now, take us through these shallows. Careful not to run up on them. The sandbars will slow us down, but the rocks will put a hole through a hole. And if you want to make a quick tack, call for half sail. She's more maneuverable then. I've already done that, like, ahead of the game. Hold don't mind it, don't right worry, away. old man. There we go. A natural. I think we've got to go a good left turn here now. Cottages. We're close. We're all in the same place. No sail. Pull everything in. Bring her in. Full stop. 
Here we go. Well done, Connor. There's the first uh, alien lesson. Do well. Oh, hello, Miss Mandy. <laughs> You're looking every bit as ravishing as I remember. Oh, God, yeah. Hmm. After all these years, you're Wouldn't still leave the on it, mate. to pay me compliments. <laughs> We are looking for David. I think he's still been on the run. <laughs> nice to see you too. Robert Faulkner. Where yeah. the hell you been? Sorry for leaving like I did, lads, but where I was going, no one could know. You two working much? No. Between contracts at the moment. Well, we're looking for gunnery officers. Yeah. What would you two say to working with me again? They don't look like we're doing much. We're getting into a few more scraps. <laughs> <laughs> Good show. The Aquila is a fine vessel. We're fitting all the guns as we speak. Looks like your friend's about to catch a beating. Where is Charles Thanks. Lee? I don't much care for your tone, boy. Mm -hmm. Yeah, give him a good hey, idea. Uh, on it. That biddle. Bobby Faulkner turned to wet nursing. <laughs> it's good you finally realize you're a shite sailor. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Not <laughs> in here, gentlemen. A <laughs> shite sailor. Not at all, Bobby. Take your friends and get out. Let's go, boys. Our guns ought to be ready. Come on. Yeah, I wouldn't have helped him. The left corner sorts him out. And he would have done. Come on, Connor. No pattern now. Let's get this boat on the road. Ship on the seas. I'll call it a boat. All sails tight and clean, sir. What the bloody hell was that about? Oh, what's that in there? What's that? The glitch. Well, but I was on the only seven the seas now, sir. So. Who was he with? Templar. The young buck was Nicholas Biddle. Nobody sails before the mast. Midshipman for the crown. Are the guns ready? Aye, but we won't jump in over our heads. We'll find a suitable target and show you how they work. We hey. fitted her with a modest amount of guns to start, but rest assured there's ample room to add more should you feel the need. Okay, let's find out our way to where we need to be. Looks like a British frigate with half seas over. Should do nicely for a spotted target practice. Bring her around broadside, and when all guns are on target, call fire. Okay. Round shot for a start. Ready out to fire. Fire. Hack up, hack. Reload. Ready, sir. Well done, boy. Now, aim all guns at her bow and do as much damage as possible. Prepare to fire! Okay. Missed. Let's bring her round again. Swivel guns a turn. More precise. Hit those okay. old powder barrels and light up the sky. Okay. Swivels, 
Yeah, go on. We got one anyway. Took a bit of time there. You are a fast learner, provided something interests me. Yeah, of course. <laughs> Getting a taste for the open sea, are we? Let's we'll go. Jack Tar out of you yet. Now we should be getting back. The old man is like to have my hide for keeping you out so long. Let's go. Bound to be something on the way, isn't it? Shooting at us. We'll tear you a new one. Destroying Ready property of the fire. crown, disturbing the king's peace. Take your pick. What do we do? Naught else but to fight back. Sink the bastards. Well, let's give them a run for the money, eh? We're sailing into the wind. Alter your course. Make ready, boys. Well, have it. Don't worry. Now, for some reason, hang on, let's, let's just pull it around the other way. Take it all. We're gonna have to get away. What do you reckon? Four oh, frigates. This is not as maneuverable as the other ones on the other.
to take some some strength back in the ship. Not allowed there, he's gonna desynchronize us. Not allowed to do that. Oh well. We found out too late there. <laughs> well the maneuverability of this one's nowhere near nowhere near as good. There is on uh, black flag. to take this one head on I think Connor, you can do it. and then the lever. Going down. You got it. <laughs> yeah. Look on an English frigate. The well, there you go. The warships you got to worry about. I'm loving it. I really am. <laughs> oh well. Another battle won. A bit of a seaman there. I got them, all of them. You get what I need, and I'll give them to you. Simple. <laughs> you got a ship. The crazy to old seaman. To boot. Ship, well, that shipwreck man? guy. Him? Some old salt always on about letters he's got from Captain Kidd. Nonsense, really. But he doesn't hurt no one, so I'll leave him be. Talk to him if you fancy, but be warned he'll chew your ear off. Anyway, the Aquila's here for you. If you should get a pang for the open sea, we'll be waiting. Now, okay. I implore you to head up the hill before the old man comes out of retirement just for me. You're going to speak to that old guy. I got a feeling. <laughs> <laughs> 
thanks. And not even a goodbye before you lift. <laughs> They're Sorry. never happy. Well, what are you waiting for? I'm gonna have to take this ass off. Put them on. You wouldn't believe how hot it is here. Look oh, at these other guys out there. They're in hotter places, but it's warm today. Once upon a time, we had a ceremony on such occasions. But I don't think either of us are really the type for that. You have your tools and training. Your targets and goals. And now <laughs> you have your title. Welcome to the Brotherhood, Connor. Yeah, welcome to the Brotherhood. Here you go. Connor's in the Brotherhood now. Oh, where do you think he's going to go now? What do you think he's going to do? Oh. Welcome back, Desmond. You'll be happy to hear there's actually good news for once. Yeah, that's good. Makes a change. I've managed to locate a power source, and it's relatively close by. Up for a trip to Manhattan? Is it safe to leave? Abstergo's got to be looking for us. Obviously, it's not safe. Can't exactly sit around here hoping to get lucky, though, can we? We need that power source. <laughs> no. Besides, I'm sure you can cook up some way to hide our movements. You say to the points any of this guy. Maybe. The Templars have access to all kinds of satellites and camera systems. We'll need to find a way to mask our digital signature. I could probably camouflage the van, too. But there's not much I can do for us. That's an easy one. <laughs> That's an easy one. Where do you think he's going to go now? Local utility companies have assured the public that they're completely prepared for the upcoming solar maximum. Disruptions to service are expected to be minimal. And a simulate being in the wagon. If only they knew. Yeah, not a very good wagon, is it? A remote operated camera. It'll provide us with a feed while you're on mission. This will let us talk to each other. We're almost there, so listen up. The artifact is in an office penthouse in Lower Manhattan. At this time of night, direct <laughs> doing Star Trek? is going to get you noticed. I think we're better off having you drop in from above. What do you mean, above? Oh. Never parachuted it before. I might get scared. Ooh, ooh, ooh. One, two, three. Yep, read you just fine. Now why don't you power One, two, three. One, two, three. One, Sean? For someone who doesn't like heights. Okay, I mean, got to go that way. 
Oh dear. Come on. What do you get? Oh, I thought he was going to fall there. I don't want to fall there. We've got to get up there. They're just here. I don't know, there's nothing to tell me where it is, is there? Soon, gotta go up that, up that. Highest point, if you know what I mean. Usually the way, if you don't like, you don't like heights, it's usually the tallest point of the tippity top. And then, free run over there. Free run over there. Oh gosh. Where have we gotta go now? Come here. I don't like this idea. Oh that's when don't be doing that. Jesus. Look on the bright side. No security to worry about. Right side, the slightest misstep means you're effectively uh, defaced. Shut up, Sean. I'll get through there. There we go. Hmm. to the tip of the top. In this at all. Thank God Don't for that. You're ready, but wait for my signal to open the chute. Timing's really important here. Too soon or too late, and you'll miss the building. 
Okay, what have I got to do here? One path. to say I enjoy most of these games but I didn't enjoy that. I don't like heights at all. <laughs> it's strange if you're going to be playing Assassin's Creed because a lot of it is a height isn't it? Not the high though. Not the high. Mm. Not like very much like an apple does it? That wasn't so bad. So, you must be Desmond. Yeah. Not exactly what I expected, but I guess your kind doesn't have many options these days. Who are you? Ask your father. Now give me that. I don't think so. Look, I'm not supposed to kill you, but the boss man didn't say anything about fucking you up. So you got to the camp. There you go. What happens when you start arguing with Desmond? Start a mess you so up. Who the hell is Dan Cross? Believe it or not, he used to be an assassin. The assassin, the way I've heard it told, but it turned out he was a sleeper agent for Abstergo, programmed to infiltrate and destroy the organization. How did he know you were there? We could be compromised. They must have caught me snooping inside their network and sent Cross to see what we were after. If they were aware of our current location, we'd know. Though, I will say this. Doesn't bode very well for future expeditions. I've set up some cameras topside. If anyone shows up, we'll see it. Be vitamins. I'd suggest you go see about finding a socket <laughs> for that power source. Or we can return to Connor if you prefer. All the artifacts in the world won't mean a thing without the key. Look at old H2O. Oh, well. Okay, so where are we going to go now? I'm gonna go in this way because it's the right light. I don't think it is the way, but it might be. I wanna go back in the anim animus, I think. What have I got there? Reckon. Can't tell you where to go, does it? Nothing. Say. I know everyone thinks I'm being silly, but I can't shake the feeling we're being watched. We are being watched. By Juno. Or yeah. some version of her. Do you think it's a recording? Or is she a ghost? Or something else? It's something she talking else. to us the way Minerva talked to Ezio? No clue. I mean, who knows what else they were working on down here? There's still so many rooms we don't have access to. But do you think she's like literally down here, waiting somewhere, still alive? Still alive? That's mental. That I mean she'd be at least 
75, 80,000 years old? They're powerful, yeah, but not that powerful. They came down here looking for a way to survive. Maybe they found one. Maybe they did. Was it weird seeing Cross? What do you mean? It's different for you. You don't know about what happened, I guess. For a long time, he was important to us. He was a different person. Yeah, Sean said he was, was a sleeper agent, like Lucy. It was different. She made a choice, but Cross, if you read the files, Abstergo just, they, they did terrible things to him. Rebecca? Nice. You're lucky. We all are. We have people who care about us, who look out for us. He was all alone, and the people he thought he could trust, they used him. Did you know him? No. Um, no. The way it goes, it all being used. I knew Hannah. Who's that? She tried to help him. She trusted him. But there was a raid about a year ago. She stayed behind so the others could escape. Tried to reason with him to see if she could fix things. Well, what happened? What do you think happened? He killed her. That's what he does. That's all he knows how to do. Sometimes it seems like that's all any of us know how to do. Rebecca. Yeah, I wanna know. That's clearly not the way up. There's gonna be another way, isn't it? Sounds very familiar. AI, eh? Or AI, rather. Not AI, eh?
go. Move the level. Well, that is supposed if to be the sun. Sun's cruel embrace. Perhaps we might rebuke it. Already we could generate the fields to protect us in times of strife. But these were small and simple things. To replicate them on a scale the size of a world. We lack the energy to make it so. Half the mm. world, they said then. It is better than none at all. We tried. Again, we failed. Again, you failed. A quarter, they asked. Even this we could not do. A sixth, an eighth, a tenth, they cried. The answer was still the same. Perhaps in time a city might be spared. But it was time we did not have. I didn't think Jonah, yeah, Juno would be in... Um, Imperial being metric, wouldn't she? Okay, well, that travels over there, obviously. Wonder what's inside. We'll soon find out. And one way to find out. Ooh, what's happening? Here you go. Magic. Who knows where their magic there? I will soon therefore now I'll try and get back. Yeah, but 
pounds. There's only one way to find us. Well, to make that one out. Certain in its existence and only awaiting discovery? Or might it be changed? Here we learned the answer and thought that it might be. They were used to command, to control, to own. Oh, you buy bodies though. Another use. You reckon? When enough sat in thrall and were told to believe, their thoughts took on form. What was imagined became If a hundred minds could wish away a wall or create a tree, what might a thousand... An intriguing story, isn't it? Ten thousand. Right. More. Might we change the consensus and will the threat away? Well, I don't think so. to send one into the sky where it might illuminate us all. Once placed, a sentence would be uttered. Into the make sun. Us safe. In this way, we would change the consensus. We would save the world. Save the world, eh? But it never came to be. Sent a dozen of them skyward, but there was no way to maintain control, to direct the beam, to enthrall the world, to speak the words. Though this was 
strange and dangerous. What we tried next was worse. Like it, uh, experimenting. The human race in the air. What is it? Maybe more to this story, I think. That way, when it. That'll be something else. Decision, mate. Lucy was going to betray us and take the apple back to Abstergo. I saw the satellite launched. I saw them turn it on, and then it failed. Come on, Desmond. You, I'm Whatever sure you'll solve it. Out of that door, it benefits Juno. We need to be careful. Careful, Tess. Careful. Steady yourself. Oh, 
to get up over there now.
que sucede es Todo cerrado, pero se va a ser Desmond, there you are. Can I ask a favor? Maybe. When this is all over, I'd like to try turning the dial back on the Animus. Like, all the way back. To the time of the first civilization. You think it would work? There was no real loss of fidelity when you visited Altair. Then again, that was about a thousand years ago, and I'm looking at going back at least 70,000 more. Sure, I'd be up for it. It'd be interesting to see what things were like back then. Excellent. I think it would prove most enlightening. She's over there again. Oh, oh, oh. Not there. She disappeared on me.
is in it. We got lost. We got lost.
use this view again. Right. Well, we're going to go through all that again, but I'm not going to. Thanks very much for watching the uh, stream. Hope you enjoyed it. It got a bit tricky at the end there for me. I just need a rest now. Take a break. Um, don't forget, if you do like it, hit the notification bell. Hit the subscribe button. Give me a like. Give me a comment if you would, please. And I'll see you in the next one. I'm going to try and do one a week. Okay? Thanks very much. On back into the shadows. Peace.